mkandarasi wa hiki pande cha barabara cha Tungama kwenda Pangani nadhani ndo mmetupokea si ndo nyinyi na nyinyi msizingue mko nyuma ya muda nimesimama nime hapa kuzungumza ya kwa msisi mkata sasa ninakoenda huko atuchekeani hii barabara mko nyuma ya muda mmesaini mkataba lini who is the project manager when did you sign the contract with the government tell, tell us when did you start when did you sign the contract uh, we signed 2021 August but yes. and uh, we commenced uh, at uh, April 2022 yes exactly yeah. April last year yes you are you are 19 months Mm. on site. Exactly. Yes. Is that correct? Exactly. Yes. 19 yes. months has already elapsed. Yes. yes. And you are supposed to be at 48.6% according to the contract. Mm. That's the plan. That's the plan? Yes. No. As of today, you are supposed to be at that level. Yes. But right now, you stand at 29.3%. You are behind by 19.2 percent. I want to know why you have delayed and what measures you are taking to catch up with the lost time. Honorable Minister, uh, we last year the abnormal rain at uh, this area is uh, the delay for our project. And uh, what we take our plan is uh, we uh, will mobilize more resources to invest in the project to catch up the progress on time. We will finish on time for this project. Our Katu Anasen Mkataba, our Kujua Tanzania Tunamisimu Yambua na Nakiangazi. Kwa nini sababu wanazo zitoa kwamba kulikuwa kuna mvua mwaka jana? Ina maana wakati wa nasaini wa kujua kwamba tuna msimu ya mvua na kiangazi. Huu mradi hauendi vizuri mtendaji mkuu. Sasa hizi asilimia 19.2 ambazo wako nyuma umechukua hatua gani? Mheshimiwa Waziri pamoja na hatua ambazo tumeweza kuzichukua ni kwamba tumemwelekeza mkandarasi aongeze vifaa na aonge awe na schedule of activities ambayo yani mpango wa kazi ambao unaendana kukacha e, hiyo e, kuru, yani kile kitendo cha yeye kutokuwa kwenda na wakati kwa sasa hivi yuko nyuma kwa asilimia tisa ya mpango wake wa kazi na tarehe 14 mwezi Novemba tuliwaita makao makuu kukaa kikao cha high level na baadaye tarehe 28 mwezi huu tumawaita tena kuona je yale tulikubaliana katika kikao cha tarehe 14 wameanza kuyatekeleza kwa hiyo mkuu e, mheshimiwa waziri nitaendelea kufuatilia kuona wanafanya, wanafanya kile ambacho tulikaa nao tarehe 14 Novemba kama tulikubaliana mtendaji mkuu au akichelewa mnachukua hatua gani tunabembelezana tu Mmechukua hatua gani? Mheshimiwa Waziri, katika mkataba kuna kipengele cha kumkata hela liquidated damages. Na sisi tayari tulishaandika barua ya kuwapa notes kwamba wakishindwa kumaliza mkataba ndani ndani wakishindwa kumaliza kazi ndani ya muda uliopangwa, basi sisi tutaanza kumkata liquidated damages. Iko ndani ya mkataba na tumeshawapa hiyo notes kwa barua. Hivi mnajua wa Tanzania tunao wacheleweshea kupata lami kama ni kuwalipa gharama yake unajua yani wananchi hawa serikali ishaleta fedha lakini mkandarasi anatuchelewesha huyu msimamizi wa mkandarasi anatuchelewesha tanlord niliwaambia nileteeni barabara zote ambazo ziko kwenye worst case hii amkuleta hii haimo kwenye barabara ambazo umeniletea sasa umeona ni kwa nini nimemfukuza mkurugenzi wa barabara Bonifasi Mkumbo kama mkurugenzi wa barabara amekuwa ni sehemu ya kusababisha haya. Umeona ni kwa nini nimemsimamisha kazi? Sasa na huyu ambaye amekuja acting mkurugenzi wa barabara iko wapi? Wewe utakii kuwa ofisini. 
watakao unazunguka nchi hii unaniletea taarifa ya miradi ambayo inasuasua ili tuchukue hatua na mkurugenzi mtendaji kama utachukua hatua ndani ya, ya, ya muda unaotakiwa nitamshauri mheshimiwa rais akubadilishe hatuwezi kuendelea hivi kwa mkurugenzi kaimu mkurugenzi wa miradi wa, wa, wa miradi standard tumekuamini tume tumekaimisha tume ili usimamie haya umeona hii nimekuja na wewe ili uone na yule aliyokuwa kabla yako kuja kumtoa hapo imekuwa mbinde kwa sababu ya kulindana sasa mkurugenzi mtendaji baada ya hao utakuwa wewe usipobadilika haiwezekani mimi siwezi kwenda kwenye kila kipande cha barabara ninawaamsha nyinyi muamke kabla sijawaamsha tumeelewana sasa hiyo mipango ambayo umeniambia naenda kukagua hii barabara lakini sitaki wakandarasi wa aina hii kuna yule CR7 Awa ni CR15 unaweza ukakuta ni mtu na binamu yake yule CR7 ni shida miradi kama sita imesimama ime kwa sababu ya kuundikwa miradi hii barabara ya kwa msisi mkata ndugu wananchi imesikia mipango ya serikali sasa ngoja nikakague barabara hii ambayo hawa natuchezea